Hey, hey guys, God bless. Welcome back to Twist and Shout. I'm Shar, and I'm going to be sharing with you um, something I already shared before, but I want to kind of, you know, re-innovate this idea, this concept, and show you what I found. Um, I recently went to the Goodwill, and I found this, which looks like it was a business, like car, auto, calendar, phone book, everything to like. So I cut this out of here. Use the piece piece of black duct tape to match in here, which black is the only I have, so it was the only choice. And I'm gonna, um, I had intended for um to put a Bible in here. I actually intended for this one, but then I discovered something interesting. This one obviously wasn't intended to be like a journaling binder, so it does not have a pocket going this way. It only has one here and one here. So I may have to do a switcheroo, which this is the one that my sister got me for Christmas. And I'm like, oh, I love it. However, unfortunately, because of the tabs on this particular Bible, it does not fit. Or if it does fit, it will actually, I will have to bend my tabs. And I don't want to do that because that will ruin them. So what I have to do is, is take this particular Bible out of this one, right? And do something that probably would match anyway. This Bible actually looks like it coordinates with that anyway. And just slide that one in here and let this one be its cover. And these are like the old school covers. Like people are kind of like, um, they're not too big on these anymore. Um, mainly I know for me personally, I don't sit there and say, Oh, let me get something to carry my Bible around like this. Like there are inconvenient sizes and stuff. So people just kind of want to see them out in that way. But this is, this one fits much nicer and it actually can zip up. So there you go that one zips so I'll put that one up there and then for this one this is larger obviously it's only on one side however this is uh probably good for this particular bible because i tend to take this one out a lot and just sit down with it but if i were to travel with this one this one fits like i said this one's larger Make sure I don't ruin the zipper. Hold on a sec. <laughs> oh, there you go. So, this one actually does close with this one in it. And I tried this before. Or at least I thought of it. Did I? I thought I did. Hold on. So, you gotta make sure it's just right. Or maybe I didn't. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> well, I'm not going to mess with it right now. Oh, I don't mess up my sticker. But anyway, another thing is, obviously it was plain black, so I put my stickers on here, which I probably have to um, glue them down and keep them intact. But this is a really cool, inexpensive way. I think this one just isn't. Cause it's right there on the fold and i think that's what the problem is so i might have to actually move that over like that you want to be careful with how you're placing them but anyway so these are just wall stickers from dollar tree i have a pouch here to put papers programs in and again i can just open this up and study from this or I can take this out because, like I said, this is one-sided. So this is not permanent. This is just in the case or event. I actually want to take the Bible outside of the house. I have that extra protection. And it's a nice, smooth, easy, convenient size. So there you have it. Comment below if you're interested in this or if this seems like a good idea to you. How do you carry your Bible? Do you have like a Bible tote bag? Do you just throw it in your purse? Are you just really minimalistic and you just hold it in your hand? Let me know what you do. Like I said, this one is good because this is the Bible I'm currently studying. So if I were to leave the house, 
boom, I got protection. If I literally wanted to just take it out, I only got one side in, so I can just take the one side out and go about my business. And obviously you can always just lay it in there like that. So there you have it. All right, so that's all I just wanna share with you guys. Like I said, I've been doing this. Y'all seen my last video where I got the ones from Hobby Lobby, but this was a good find too. So just to give you an idea, like just be on the lookout of, it doesn't have to be, it can be six ring binder, three ring binder, doesn't matter, they all can come out. Your uh, main focus is the size and obviously how many pockets you will want to have. Like this is convenient enough for me to just, like I said, stick my husband's Bible study card in there in case we're traveling. Um, I have enough room or space to put this in here. If this was an issue, um, to put that in there or this pocket on the side actually holds that too. So very convenient, very easy travel, you know. So I just thought I would share. All right, so that's it for that. I absolutely love you guys. God bless, take care, bye.